Some men see things as they are and say why. I dream things that never were and say why not. All my life, I have sought to understand the universe and find answers to these questions. People who are involved in it sense there's something very special about what It is always valued pure fundamental research. All this sort of cross-fertilization that goes on produces this extraordinary science. Weichmann belongs to the whole world. It's this unbelievable inquisitiveness. Their brains, their focus, their determination, their curiosity. Science, but not how we This know is it. about making long-term investments in science. If you look back over the last hundred years, science has completely changed the way we do things and has made life much better for you and I and cured so many diseases. I can't imagine a world without science. The equation E is equal to MC square. In which I hand another door to the German Chancellor. I speak to you for the first time as Prime Minister in a solemn hour for the life of our country. And when peace comes, remember, it will be for us. Our task is not only to win the battle, will still but to win the war. This was their final battle. March past, Greece led the procession. Yes, Belgium. Yes. A Majesty being now anointed. supporters' nerves were strained to breaking point. The World Cup was within England's reach. The enduring memory of Isle of Wight 1970 is for the music. And it's okay. You turn if you want to. The ladies not for turning. In both a walk onto the hallowed outfield of Lords. Yes, very the very The large outside. task force will sail as soon as all preparations. Stay in and give us the money. There are people dying. My first memories of the Institute, of course, my first memories of Israel. I remember, and I remember it quite vividly, arriving in 1956 on the most exciting trip of our life. It was started really through a friendship, my, my grandfather's friendship with Chaim Weizmann, and I think it's incredible that a friendship could produce something which is making such a difference to people's lives. My first experience at the Weizmann Institute was sitting, having lunch with you and your father. At the age, your, your, at the, your grandfather. Yeah, my grandfather, your father, at the age of eight. And we went and saw the Daniel Seif Institute. And ever since then, uh, I've been hugely fascinated and impressed by what the scientists and the research they're doing. It's really structured and easier for people to be really creative. And there aren't very many institutions left like that in the world. 
Every year it got gradually more and more interesting. Today it is very different and has grown to such an extent. The Weizmann's very much a family um, institution. It infused my children with this sense of magic. They are the future, they and their friends and their children and their children's children. Science at the Weizmann is truly excellent and outstanding. High quality science looking at the key issues facing each successive generation. It's really the place that I can see in the world where scientists get together to increase their knowledge and then work out how that can help everybody around us. The Jewish-Israeli mind. It's just something that is laser sharp. A good example is the, um, the discovery of uh, a drug for treating multiple sclerosis. We need science, we need medicine, we need antibiotics, we need cures for cancer. Because if you think research is expensive, you try disease. One of the really extraordinary things about the Institute is the way that it really does give so many people a free reign to be curious. So you get mathematicians working in biology, biologists working in physics and so on. And the Weizmann structure is such that it's always promoted that type of interdisciplinary research. It's science, uh, it's technology, it's innovation. The future of the Weizmann really depends on the future scientists and these young scientists in their early 20s, hopefully will one day be the Nobel Prize winners of the next eight decades. It's basic science, it's long term, it's making a better place for mankind. And to me, it's just a magnificent place. As you walk around the campus, you'll see the name of the Wolfson family in many different places. It reflects their passion and enthusiasm for the work of the Institute across the decades. The Weizmann Institute is one of the most exciting things uh, experiences I've had in my life. What more can I say except that it's the most marvellous institute and many more people should go and visit it when they go to Israel. From where it started, as you say, one lab to the incredible campus it is today uh, and the work they're doing in personalised medicine and so on is, is, is outstanding. And the scale is just incredible. We don't bring people here because they have a specific research area they want to do. We bring them because they're brilliant, because they want to do innovative work and they see Weizmann as a place that will encourage that kind of activity. Just to be part of it in such a small way uh, makes me feel very proud. Weizmann's ideas are often pioneering. It belongs to the whole world, and the research that goes on there will benefit far more people than the six million inhabitants of Israel. And I think to support any major scientific research institution of this nature is not only exciting per se, but I think it's also something that is essential for future growth. This is not really about a country, it is about a, a brilliant educational institution. And what they're doing is priceless. Together. 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 Together we are celebrating eight decades, eight decades of discovery. Eight decades of discovery. Together we are celebrating eight decades Together, of discovery. Together we are celebrating eight decades of discovery.